Thanksgiving is a holiday that brought together two different cultures. The pilgrims came here with the best intentions. They, they decided to flee an oppressive people and move to a new land where they thrived and became an oppressive people. <laughs> you get certain people on the same continent, there's gonna be a problem. Pilgrims and Indians, Protestants, Catholics, my family, anybody else's family. <laughs> Too early to RSVP for Easter? Aaron's dead, killing me. I'm gonna swing by Mulaney's for dessert. <laughs> Police, break it up! <laughs> Who's the homo now? <laughs> Aaron wants the perfect Thanksgiving, but the only tools I have to make that happen are her family and my family. So, I'll bring them together in love and peace if I have to squeeze their codependent necks until they're poor Zeus gin. Titus, what's the matter with your family? Broken bones, check in with me. Cuts and bruises, have a seat. I'll be with you in a minute. Oh, Kathy, I'm glad you're here. That's how much pain I'm in. <laughs> your father called and said your shoulder was dislocated. I know how excruciating that is. I had to rush down here to tell you to take a seat. Oh, thank God the smell of blood makes your people hungry. Christopher? It's okay, honey. It's not broken. It's just dislocated. I, I want you to know we are never getting married. They'll pop it back in. I'll be fine. I'm not deformed. No. We don't belong together. Our families both suck, so we both suck. And I don't want to be with someone who sucks. And I don't want you to be with someone who sucks. Uh-huh, and you're just in shock. No, no. I've never been more serious about anything in my entire life. We are not getting married. Did, did that hurt? Yeah. The woman I love more than anything just said she wouldn't marry me. No, that. I just touched you on the shoulder like this. Don't! <laughs> I'm talking about Erin. Oh. Well, before you could surprise her with the engagement ring, well, you got rejected! <laughs> I did not get rejected. You got shut down. Dave, <laughs> off on the runway. Titus going down to flames. <laughs> You're right, Dave. Oh, my God. You're right. Dude. I'm just screwing with you. I know. Stop it. <laughs> she just had a bad day. She's in shock. I need to snap her out of it. Nothing clears a woman's head quicker than a huge diamond ring. Huge? Well, that's a nice size. You know, good cut, medium color. I don't make a lot of money. Back off! <laughs> Honey, I have something for you. Nothing I want from you. Please go away. Honey, I just want to talk to you. I'm going to have to spend my entire life alone. I have to get a lot of cats. <laughs> Take a minute. You're gonna need a huger diamond. <laughs> Kathy, can we get something to calm Aaron down right now? And when you get a second, my shoulder's below my nipple. Can you still do this? Yeah. Then sit your ass down. <laughs> I think my hand is broken. I need some medical marijuana. It's Aaron's sister. I can vouch for her. Oh, and some rolling papers or an aluminum can. Hon, we need to talk about this never seen me again thing. Look, I found a turkey. <laughs> Okay, let's start there. Gobble, gobble, gobble. Nora, can you help me with your daughter? Your father's a found mouth son of a bitch. Hon, listen to me. Hey, nice. 
dinner. That's all I wanted, a perfect moment so I could tell my parents that we were getting married so they would finally say to me, we're proud of you, Aaron. A simple, beautiful moment that you ruined. I understand. I ruined? <laughs> That's right. I'm the big old problem. It's all Titus. <laughs> oh, man. Mm. Creamy. White meat or dark meat? <laughs> Creamy. You are the one who invited Hitler. Oh, I'm Hitler. Christopher and I are breaking up because of you. You're breaking up because of me? Yeah, we're breaking up because of you. See, I'm with you. Rejected! I told everyone to behave. I didn't think I had to tell you. You are an instigator. I never liked you. You can't invite a normal guy into a room with 15 damaged people. Putting Tommy near Aaron's brother Michael is kind of like giving a gazelle a complimentary pass to Lion Country Safari. <laughs> the key to forgiveness is homemade bread. I'll have some homo bread, homo. Honey, they like to be called gay. I'm not gay, I choose women. But you had to make a choice. Okay, that's it. Would a homo do this? <laughs> My bad. I should have used words instead of fists. You suck! Uh, 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 honey, is it possible that your uh, ex-convict gun-toting brother maybe nudged Tommy into unleashing the loaf of fury? Oh, oh I'm sorry. Maybe, maybe we should thank Tommy for showing us what a mistake we were making. Quit saying that! No, you quit! You're the one who invited Tommy! Ah! Can I get a little of the good stuff for the shoulder? Sure, come with me. Hello, chair. <laughs> you, uh, might want to bite your wallet. My wallet? <laughs> Titus, this place is starting to freak me out. Did you hear that little girl screaming? <laughs> yeah, what's her deal? Aaron's finally calmed down. You should give it to her now. Give her what? Nothing. She's not ready for it. Not ready for what? Nothing. Oh, I know what it is. I'm gonna get one for my mom. An engagement ring? Oh, my God! Dave, he's gonna marry his mom! A woman dreams a special moment. Her first kiss, meeting Mr. Wright. Hello. <laughs> and, and telling her parents she's getting married. Everybody, everybody, Christopher and I have an announcement. Shh, shh, shh. Today is about more than just Thanksgiving. You are here because you are the important people in our lives. <laughs> right, honey? You're in our lives, people. We're finally begging God's forgiveness for living in sin. <laughs> God ain't gonna take that call. Protestant. Heathen. Uh, they're not heathens, they're engaged. Oh! oh my God, I bet you wanted to say that. Oh my God, why don't you just go back in time and tell her there's no Santa Claus? <laughs> I agree with Dave, you should give her the ring. Put it in a pie. <laughs> she doesn't want the ring. She wants a perfect moment. It was supposed to be Thanksgiving dinner. And we're gonna do it here. What? Yeah, I finish what I start. Damn right. You take Merritt, I'll take Nora. She's wiry. <laughs> no fighting, Erin doesn't want fighting. She wants eating. We are having Thanksgiving dinner right here. Here? Aaron will be happy today. There's no turkey, there's no stuff. Everyone will be happy today. <laughs> there's a cafeteria and there's vending machines. Hey, it's a horn, no plenty. Yeah. <laughs> then it's payback, Nora. Yup, yup. <laughs>
<laughs> it takes a lot of strength and an inner steel forged by years of painful memories to stare truth in the face and go, la, 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 la. If it weren't for the Protestants, we'd all be living in teepees. Oh, <laughs> Don't you think it's going great? Why, because no one's gutted anybody yet? Don't be silly. They love the corn. What part are you at? Your mother is hammered and abusive. She's celebrating. Your, your father beat your brother like he's a rental. He was ignoring my corn. Your druggy sister sold my druggy brother drugs. She's starting her own business. Michael has called Tommy a homo so many times, I think he wants to date him. Isn't Michael handsome? Hun, you're gonna have to face these no offense losers and tell them what you think of them or you'll live this nightmare the rest of your life. Don't be so negative. Come on, let's tell them we're getting married. Okay. Whatever you want. Everybody, Christopher and I have an announcement. I got a tablecloth for the table. Oh, perfect. As long as you didn't get it off some dead guy. <laughs> he didn't need it. Hey, kitty cat. I told you they'd be bloody. That's all right, Daddy brings the sugar. Hi, did you give her the ring yet? Tommy? World spinning, can't focus. Don't ruin this, this is important to me. Ah, first marriage always is. Honey, your family and my family, Thanksgiving dinner, the kind you eat, not the kind you throw. Wait, 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 I gotta stand up. <laughs> The pilgrims and the Indians put aside their differences and shared a quiet meal. They came together in love, peace, harmony, and corn. Well, the Indians called it maize, but we corrected them with our fire sticks. I'm fine. So, Ken, I hear you're tying the knot. Where are you going, for the record? Nora, that's not Thanksgiving talk. Think like a pilgrim. <laughs> Kathy will be number six. That's one wife for each glass of rubbing alcohol you've had tonight. Who likes corn? <laughs> I bet Tommy likes corn. What does that mean? It's going great. Good water. Oh, I got it. <laughs> this is water. <laughs> All right, listen up, everybody. We are going to eat like a family. I swallowed a lot of blood. I'm full. <laughs> Look, I'm asking you to help me with your daughter. I'm not asking you to come over to my shop at midnight and cobble some shoes. <laughs> I like this guy. <laughs> Isn't he wonderful? You showed me what losers you all are. Honey? No, that's what you said. I love them, but they're losers. Honey, please. No, 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 no. You're right. You're right. Ooh, Kim has problems. She's had a hard life, but she did what she had to do. Drugs. <laughs> and men. And men for drugs. <laughs> she is like, woo! <laughs> Honey, I have something for you. This proves I love you because I realize that I can't live without you. So will you marry me and accept this as a token of my love? Oh. <gasps> An empty velvet box. <laughs> it's a metaphor for our relationship. That's what I gave my third wife. <laughs> Where's the ring? There's a ring, too? <laughs> Michael. Did you give her the ring yet? <laughs> Michael got kicked out of high school for stealing. He got put in jail for stealing. He was with these guys that used to break into houses. He stole from them. The guy's a thief. <laughs> Where the hell's my fork? <laughs> my baby, you made it! I'm on parole, I'm not dead. Hey, man. 
Hey, how's that stabbing garbage by the side of the freeway thing going? <laughs> Funny. Uh, Michael, give Christopher back his wallet. All right. Get a chain. <laughs> So hot. <laughs> nice scream, Penelope. I swear to God, man, if you don't give me that ring back, I am going to kick your ass. Oh, no. I never came up against anything like you in maximum security prison. <laughs> well, you know what they don't have in maximum security prison? What? Dad! <laughs> He stole Aaron's ring. No. Yeah. <laughs> Do you have the ring? <laughs> you know, I never hit my boys. Instead, I took years to destroy their self-esteem and mold them into upstanding citizens. With you, I don't have that kind of time. It's in my book, it's in my book! Dad never believed in hurting his kids. He believed in threatening to hurt his kids, which was effective because we never stopped being afraid that Dad might forget what he believed in. Hey, who the hell do you think you are going after my kid? Yeah. Shut up! <laughs> Why don't you teach him to be a man? Hitting him only teaches him to be a drunken Irish loser. <laughs> Sorry, we didn't know he stole your ring. Hey, don't apologize to the wussy! If he had half a brain, he wouldn't have jumped the guy in front of two cops. <laughs> you see that? That's emotional damage. That's much more powerful. <laughs> Here. Go throw your life away. Thanks, Dad. <laughs> Aaron? Hun? I, I know things didn't go exactly like we planned today. But here. You bought me a ring? Huh? No. Well, that's the drugs talking. They've worn off. Can we get her some more drugs? No, no. Christopher, get up. I, I can't marry you. I mean, look at my family. I love you too much to drag you into this. Oh, come on. My family's way more screwed up than yours. Exactly. No, wait. Your family's pretty screwed up. I mean, your mom is a tweak. There's no such thing as a perfect moment. The birth of a kid, screaming, goo. First kiss, it's your aunt. <laughs> you finally meet the woman that you're gonna spend the rest of your life with, and her family is alive. The only reason Michael went to jail is because the judge was a Protestant whore. They're Protestants, burn them all. <laughs> Keep an eye on your dad, you know how we can get it. My dad? Christopher. Please, this Thanksgiving has to be perfect. I need some help here. So, no Protestants. <laughs> Mommy, mm -hmm. can I get you something? Oh, no, honey. Mommy has her water. <laughs> that tweak, as you put it, could be the grandmother of our tweaky child. And that child is going to have the blood of alcoholics, drug addicts, and us. Sure, he'll be able to build a car, and he'll be pretty. Stop it. Stop being a baby. Oh, uh, dinner's ruined. Everybody's bleeding. Oh, oh, our kid's gonna be a mutant. Well, it's not ruined, and everybody's scabbing up. And you suck, and I suck, and our families suck. But who fits better into your life than me, huh? I mean, who better to handle this and, and them? Better than me. I am the only one who can protect you. It's a proposal, not a telethon. <laughs> and you can protect me, right? Okay, let's try this again. Aaron? You're marrying me. I know. That's beautiful, man. <laughs> Hobo! Oh, no! Who is it? Everyone over here, right now. Thanksgiving. 
This smells like a dead guy. Be quiet. Oh, ow, ow. <laughs> Expectations will burn you every time. See, all you really can do is pick a future that you love and drive towards that. Erin is my future, and I love her. Especially when she starts pimp slapping her family. <laughs> That's my parents. What are you doing? Putting the burn unit on speed dial. Oh, Christopher, <laughs> stop it. It's going to be a perfect Thanksgiving. Tommy's making his bread. <laughs> Thank you, God, for this food. We will eat it, not throw it. Hug each other, not hit each other. Love the ones we can tolerate and screw the rest. Oh, Christopher and I are getting married. Amen. I said amen. Amen! amen. Oh, it's perfect. Thanksgiving is a holiday that brought together two different cultures. And things may not always work out like you think they should, but they always work out. I'm thankful that the world's in perfect harmony at all times. The Pilgrims had it tough, but now we live in the strongest, most prosperous country in the world. And the Indians? <laughs> well, you know. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> I'm the funny one. No, I'm the funny one. No, I'm the funny one. I'm the funny one. Okay, fine.